That's right. Uh, uh, it's incredible, really. <laughs> Given uh, this is the fourth Let's Go show, there's been a couple of Forza Monthlies. We did E3. It's a Forza game, and we've yet to show any races whatsoever. <laughs> so um, I think people probably want to see that. I think, I think that's, yeah, that's something people have been clamoring for, so let's take a look. So, so no pressure, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what race are we looking at here? What details can you share today? So this is the, uh, the Emerald Circuit. It's a, a road race and an asphalt race. It's, it's really cool, and we've, we've picked it because it straddles uh, two of our biomes. So right mm -hmm. now, we are in the living desert, where you see all these awesome cactuses and rocky formations. And then as we come around this next corner, we kind of cross over into the, another biome, which is the rocky coast. Um, do you want to talk okay. about that? Yeah, so, so the rocky coast, we actually caught a little snippet of that at the very beginning of the trailer. Um, that awesome rock art that we have uh, we, we taken from uh, Kavos and Lucas. It's uh, ours now. It's, it's ours. Uh, no, uh, so there's, there's a ton more of that coast to go and explore. Um, and there's also all these, these amazing, luxurious resorts uh, because we they wanted to great. give the game another holiday destination. Um, and there's, you know, there's golf courses, uh, there's all these nice, um, you know, luxur lu luxury um, chalets to go and explore and totally trash the gardens. Um. <laughs> Make a nuisance of yourself. I'm... And we did see just a second ago as well that volcano you mentioned as well was looming in the distance. Yeah, I guess that, that gives you a sense of scale about where we are on the map versus mm -hmm. that and how far away, obviously. We, yeah. It took us quite a while to drive up the volcano and we started from halfway up. So yeah, yeah you can, <laughs> that might give you a sense of scale yeah. of how big the world is. Yeah. Yeah. So, so what uh, else is another, going uh, on around uh, this part of the map then? What else yeah. are we looking at? Um, yeah, so one, one this side, the, the rocky coast, uh, is, is pretty much... We, we, there's, well, we've got two coasts. We've got the tropical coasts on the east and the rocky coast on the west. And it's, it's actually amazing how different they, they can look. Mm -hmm. So they've got different types, they've even got different types of palm trees. Uh, they've got mm -hmm. lots of different types of foliage. Uh, the water's even different. So, that, so on the tropical coast, you get all the more emeraldy, white sandier beaches. And on the, on the rockier coast, the, the water's a little bit more turbulent. Um, it's a different sea, um, it's a different color. The, the beaches are slightly different, and you know, as the name implies, there's all this great geology to go and drive around and mm -hmm. um, you know, race around in. Right. That's a cheeky little Keen corner there. Are we going to see Andy win this, by the way? Um, <laughs> we, we, he, yeah. he is well practiced, yeah. so I think he, he is in with a shot. Yeah. Uh, Keen-eyed keen viewers may have noticed as you went through the, the start gantry, uh, it says Horizon Apex on the gantry there. That Horizon Apex is one of the festivals that you can open as you're playing through the campaign. And it's a festival that's all about road racing, asphalt racing, high performance cars on really nice tarmac like this. So, um, and that's just, yeah, one, one of those festivals you'll be able to open as you're playing. So yeah, really, really cool. And if you're into road racing, then that'll be the place for you to go and hang out. Congratulations. What else? Let's, uh, let, let's, let's duck let's, away. Let's move on. Let's through, through the magic magic of the Series X, we will, uh, we will quickly try and teleport. <laughs> what to, are uh, we going to be going to next? What um, are we going to be quick resuming and speed loading into now? <laughs> uh, we are, so we, we are going to the uh, Gran Caldera um, volcano. Uh, this is, this is the, the largest geological feature we've ever done in a Horizon game. And it, and it comes with, with you know, some great features of you can see everything from the, from the, from the volcano. Wow. You can look at the whole map. Um, we, we, when we get to the top, we'll, uh, we'll have a look. It features the largest switchbacks we've ever done as well. So uh -huh. the one we're on now, and Andy's about to do a drift zone, uh, good luck, um, oh. is, the, is the asphalt one. And on the other side is, is the dirt one. Yeah, the, 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 dirt, the dirt route especially, it gives us some, one of the most amazing yeah. downhill rally trails mm. we've ever had. It's yeah. amazing. Um, um, you, you can probably glimpse it, it when it catches the sunlight, but just how much more detail we put into the road these times around. Um, there's lots of cracks. Uh, as you actually get to the top of the volcano, the road actually deteriorates quite a bit. Uh, it turns to a cobblestone road right at the top um, because, you know, we actually found that in reference as well that um, you know, maybe they didn't want to tarmac all the way. Uh, so we tried to recreate that. Um, but yeah, there's, there's all these potholes and everything. It just makes for such an interesting drive because there's, there's a lot of switchback. And what sort of yeah. gameplay are players going to get up on the volcano? I mean, throughout the seasons as well, are seasons going to affect what we see up there? That uh, is a perfectly timed question, Charlie. So please. if we just take a look at the... Uh, yeah, the <laughs> yeah. If we, if if we, we just take a look at that rock face in front of us and we ho hold that in your mind and then if we... Uh, <laughs> if we duck away... Feed, the feed ever slightly so that we can do a little bit of magic. And, and through the magic of time, we have skipped forward <laughs> um, a couple of weeks. Yeah, two, two weeks have actually passed. Um, yeah. We have gone from summer 
to winter. Um, da, 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 da. So, um, as 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 we've mentioned before, we've got localized weather this time around. So, if it's raining on the volcano, and you drive all the way up, it'll actually turn to snow, which is which is um, which is really fun actually, because uh, mm -hmm. again, it really adds to that immersion of making it feel like you're really there. Yeah. As, as we see as we come up here as well, the snow just gets a little bit, a little bit deeper, a little bit yeah. heavier uh, as, as you come up the side of the volcano. Um, yeah, it's just a, as you say, it's a, a really great uh, seasonal experience, mm -hmm. and it's one way you just get a different experience each each season yeah. as you come and revisit these same biomes. Yeah. Just just constantly keep changing the gameplay up as you go through it. It's uh, mm -hmm. it's quite cool how much this one biome, the volcano itself, changes over one season as well. Um, I mean, it sounds like a pretty significant biome in the sense that. I mean, please correct me if I'm wrong here, I'm probably fishing, but it's a biome that's going to be visible from almost all areas of the map as well, right? Oh, yeah. yeah um, well, 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 we'll have a look in, in one of the races, which is actually, particular, yeah, it's quite far, actually, yeah, from, from far, the yeah. volcano. But, yeah, you can always see it, glo like, looming in the background. Um, yeah, it's, a, yeah. it's actually a really great feature for, for an open-world game like this to just help orientate yourself yeah. when you're just, basically, yeah. wherever you are on the map, you can kind of spin yeah. the camera and go, oh, yeah. Volcano, and yeah. you can kind of work out where you are and get your bearings yeah. using it as a. Yeah. You know, it also, just helps you, um, you know, of, you know, maybe what season am I in? Just look at the volcano, <laughs> and the amount of snow <laughs> will tell you. Back up there. <laughs> um, um, I also love that Andy is fully doing my style of driving now, which is I need to go left, so I'm just going to go through whatever I need to do to go left. <laughs> and yeah, this is the uh, this is this is the uh, caldera of the volcano, which is in other seasons. Um, a little tiny little pool of water, which is which is quite mm -hmm. cool to slide around or you know splash through, and then it, when winter it freezes over, um, as you'd expect. Um, should we uh, should we duck away again and, and change season? Yeah, speaking of other seasons, should we do that? Yeah, again? let's uh, let's have a look at spring. Or oh, okay, we're summer. going to spring. What's um, special about spring then? How can we hop in there? Um, uh, for this, for the sake of time, let's, let's go to summer. summer. Let's go to summer. <laughs> summer, um, my apologies. So, okay. so spring is spring is um, is as good as summer. It's, it's just there's <laughs> a bit more snow, um, um, but yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, that, yeah. That particular magic spell yeah. wasn't immediately to hand. Yeah. So. <laughs> um, yeah. Again, uh, this has got um, all, all the rocks we see here are all captured via photogrammetry. Um, uh, as is as is a lot of the plant work. Oh, there's, there's all this awesome marum grass. There's all, you know, hundreds of uh, thousands of photos were taken to try and accurately represent that. Uh, in fact, so are the, the textures. Also, every, all the surface you drive on um, has been pretty much re recreated from photos of the exact place. Yeah. Um, yeah there's a cool little uh, volcano research centre yeah. over here as well that yeah. you will have, I was you'll have ask to visit. What that was actually. Yeah, yeah, you, you have to visit there and do some do some research at one point in the game. <laughs> you do. Um, there's a there's a rather impressive satellite on the other side, but we're not going to go around to because because uh, it is a developer build, and um, I'm terrified. <laughs> it was it was purple recently. It's it's yeah, it's, it, not, it's it, not supposed to be purple. It was purple. Um, <laughs> should we uh, should we jump off the side of the volcano, Andy? This sounds like the first thing I think many people in chat yeah, would like to yeah. do. I mean, m many yeah. of them have been asking if you can drive through some of the billboards, but maybe we'll save that for another time, folks. Let's yeah. hurl yeah. ourselves off a volcano instead. Yeah. yeah. Andy. So, yeah, as Connor said, the, the views from up here are absolutely spectacular. Yeah. You can... You can't see the whole map in one frame because yeah. the, the volcano is kind of in the middle of the map, but as you drive around it, you can see it's all around you. It's just like this. Yeah. Looks incredible. What? And, uh, and now oh, we're gonna are you kidding me? Away. <laughs> oh, stop <laughs> it. That's just cruel. That looks yeah. absolutely incredible. Yeah. Um, and all of these biomes we're going to start talking about from today onwards. But starting tomorrow, you'll be seeing for coverage for all of the biomes on the Forza social channels. So